Uh, let me ask you... Uh, a course, question? He did, yeah, I'm going to do one question in this interview, just for the fun of it, just to see what it's like. You need a break, don't you? No, I don't need a break. I can do this for 40 more years. Um, I cry myself to sleep. Uh, <laughs> the election. This election's getting very heated. It is? Everyone's talking about the Swift Boat ads, the Kerry Swift Boat ads, which there's a, there's a sense that we've reached a new level of vitriol, a new low. What did you think of the Swift Boat ads? Not just, not just a new low, but a, a, a new sense of people not getting the big picture. I mean, how come John Kerry, the guy who went to war, is the one who's defending himself about defense? Right. How come the public can't tell the difference between the war hero and the former town drunk? <laughs> you know, I mean... I will say this, that, 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 that what struck me about the Swift Boat ads is that I thought, wait a minute, the guy went... Uh, to, to to war, and no matter what you think, he was shot at. He went to war, he and was he was shot, shot at. Not and, just at, right. shot. And so that's where the discussion should end. We should, we... He, exactly. But they say he threw his medals away. You know what? He could have made his medals into a roach clip and smoked <laughs> pot with Ho Chi Minh. It still would have been better than what the other guy did. <laughs> Maybe... <laughs> Maybe it doesn't matter. Right. What's I just thought I'd really like that image of the, if there's a way to do it. You know? Oh, I've done it. Um, <laughs> cool medals, yeah, but look what they can do. Wow. <laughs> they taper the end, uh-huh. I mean, maybe it doesn't matter what George Bush did during Vietnam. Okay, he was in rehab. But, um, <laughs> but it, it, it seems to me like people are just missing the big picture here, and that is partly John Kerry's fault. I mean, mm -hmm. I'm not surprised that Bush would go that low, but John Kerry didn't call him out at right. his own convention. Right. He didn't fight back enough. Right. Uh, and, and that's what you have to do. John Kerry is using the Al Gore playbook, which is, look, I'm not going to differentiate myself too much from this guy, because when people get in the voting booth, they're going to go, well, I don't like John Kerry so much, but the other guy is a retard, okay? <laughs> so it's not a problem. I right. mean, even if I don't like the Democrat, the other guy is still eating paste. So I will... <laughs> and that... That strategy didn't work for Al Gore, and it's not going to work for, for Kerry. You look weak. Right. People think, you know what, if you can't stand up to Bush, how are you going to stand up to a smart guy like bin Laden? Right, right. No, I'm, I'm with you 100%. <laughs> you need I'm, a break. I was picturing them eating paste. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> ah, good lord. All right, well... Your hair on... looks redder on TV. Isn't it? Look, yeah, you know what it is? You know, it's really brown in person. You know what it is? It's the lighting we use here. When you... I walk around, and now we're talking about something important for a change. <laughs> this is what the country cares about. They don't care about the election. It's the lighting here. I walk around, and people are like, yeah, you're not a redhead, and then they hit me right in the throat. <laughs> Real Time, this woman's like, oh, that's sad. Real Time with Bill Maher airs Friday nights at 11 on HBO. Do you, you must, uh, we're out of time, but you must like being on HBO because you can pretty much, you have free reign, say whatever you want on HBO. You know, I, uh, people, that's a bit of a misnomer. People think that, but I actually had free reign pretty much on ABC. I used to say whatever I wanted. Right. The difference is I got fired. Right, That's right. the difference, but right. I did used to always say what I wanted. Well, and tomorrow night you can see Bill perform at Playhouse Square <laughs> in Cleveland. Bill Maher, thanks so much for being here. Dwayne Doug Chapman coming up. We'll take a break. We'll be right back.